Hello everybody, in today's video, I have a quarantine power hour for you. I actually would do this even if I was not in the isolation that we all are right now, but you guys know what I mean. All right, so let's get some oil in the diffuser. So I actually chose motivation and I put some on the top of my head and put some in the diffuser because I swear this oil blend makes me just go and go and go like the Energizer Bunny and I needed all of the energy support that I could possibly get. So the first thing that I had to tackle was the laundry. I had five loads of laundry to put away, which was a little excessive. This, you can't even see how big this pile is because it stretches all the way across the bed <laughs> it's a little, a little excessive, um, and it was time to put it away. So what I'm doing is I am just grouping like items together and folding items um, just to, you know, small little bundles. These all fit into an armoire. I don't have a, a closet here for um, the clothes to hang into because that's Christmas storage. So I fold them all up and I put them away in an armoire. And so I like to group like items together. So all of my sleep clothes together, all of my daytime, normal, regular clothes together. I like to put all of my jeans together and then I put my athletic clothes all together too. And I try to fold them in a way where they won't be super wrinkled, but... I haven't been doing a very good job of that lately because I've had to use my um, little garment steamer like every single day, but I love my garment steamer, so it's fine. It's very gratifying to see all the wrinkles like fall out of your clothes. Is it just me? Moving on. All right, so now <laughs> I'm going to go ahead and change the sheets on the bed. So we have one set of sheets for this bed, so it's a blessing and a curse. Like I literally, when I take them off the bed, I have to take them downstairs to the washer and then immediately put them in the dryer or else I will not have sheets to sleep on. So I guess a blessing in disguise here really gets me motivated to actually fully change the sheets and put them back on and all the things. Um, so I've got to get my husband's weighted blanket off of this side. I love this thing. He likes it too. I'll link it below the one we have if you guys are interested in it. Um, it's been really good for like the anxiety of all the things right now. Um, so anyway, so getting all of the sheets off and then once I have them off the bed, I like to spray down the mattress pad and it shouldn't surprise anybody. <laughs> I spray it down with essential oils, right? So I have a little spray bottle um, that I fill with water and then I put about 10 or so drops of lavender in there and about 10 drops of chamomile. And then I just, I use Roman chamomile and then just spray it on the mattress pad. All right. So they are down in the washer washing and so I'm going to vacuum. So this is a Bissell pet vac and we don't have pets but I have very long hair and I have burned out the motors on probably four vacuums in my lifetime now. This is number five and it works really really good and so I realized if it's going to be sucking up hair that I'm shedding I might as well get a pet vac and I work I like it a lot so I'll link it below if you guys are interested in seeing that um, and getting that if you have long hair too. Um, and then I'm going to take my stick vac, this is another Bissell, and then I'm just going to um, vacuum up the fuzz and hair and whatever that is on the floor of the bathroom, and then I'm going to steam mop it. Um, this steam mopper, I will not link below because it is awful. <laughs> Do not recommend the Dirt Devil steam mop. It does not work well, but it's what I have, so it's what I'm using, and we're just going to deal with it. But it, So I, it steams fine, it just does not work very well, but it's fine. So going to get that done and then um, pop over to the tub. So the tub has these little floor grippers that I use a charcoal bar soap. It's like a black soap and it just kind of collects in the little foot grippers. So I'm making a paste out of baking soda and then a couple of glugs of the Thieves Household Cleaner and then a couple of squeezes of um, Dr. Bronner's Unscented Castile Soap. And I'm just using a little, you know, knife to just mix it around. And then I'm going to use this as a paste with a washcloth on the tub floor and the walls and everything and look at that it works so good it's all shiny I'm in love with this like homemade soft scrub it is the best so then I'm just gonna take my thieves cleaner and spray everything in the bathroom from the toilet to the window and mirror and counter and everything to clean it all off and that made my timer go off. <laughs> I was done with my power hours. So I hope you guys are doing good. I hope you guys are finding some sort of joy with all of this quarantining thing that we're doing. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Take care. Thanks for watching, guys.